All right, what's going on, people? I'm here to show you how to root your Galaxy Tab 4 8 inch. Now, I've been watching a lot of videos. Don't nobody got a video on this, which would have been so simple to do, but they make it so hard. So, I'm going to make it so easy for you guys already. Those of you who already know how to root, this would be easy for you. Those who don't know how to root, this would be kind of hard for you. With that being said, let's jump right back into this thing. You're going to open up your tab. You're going to do one of those. You're going to swipe down that bar right there. You're going to go into your settings. From your settings, you're going to go into your general. From your general, you're going to go about device. Now... With that being said, you want to get that model number right there. Whatever your model number is, you want to get that right there. Chalk that down on a piece of paper. All right? Now, from there, you got to go to build number. Tap that a few times until developer options pop up. Now, once developer options pop up, you go to developer options. Scroll down to US debugging. You want to click that. Then you go back here. And then you go back into security. Once you go into security, you got to make sure you click unknown sources. If you don't click that, it won't let you do anything to this. It won't allow no incoming traffic in at all. So once that's done, you're going to click out. Power your device all the way down. Turn it off. Once you turn your device off, you want to hold the down, the volume button down, the power button, and the home button at the same time. When you see this quick thing pop up on the screen, you want to hit up on your volume real fast. Once you do that, you'll be in Odin mode. Now, once you get to Odin mode, you back back just a little bit. And then you go to CF Auto Root Respiratories. Once you go to CF Auto Root Respiratories, you scroll down and you look for that model number. All through this, you have to look for your model number. Once you find your model number, you download that. Once you download that, you'll go to Google, which I'm not going to do, but I'll do it right here real quick for you. Go to Google. You go to Google. And then you type in Odin 3. See it already popped up. Odin 3.10.7. Once you get that right there, you download that straight from the Samsung store. Once you download that, you should get a, a package which got four files inside of them. You want to click on that Odin file and open that Odin file up. Now from that Odin file you'll get something that looks like this, Odin 3. Now once you get here, your tab is still hooked up already. See, my tab is still hooked up. I'm already rooted, so I'm not gonna root it again. Once you get here, you wanna go here, you wanna unclick Auto Reboot and leave everything else the same way. From there, you go to BL. You hit BL, and you should already have the recovery set up on your desktop from this folder here. So I'm gonna open this folder here, and this is what your folder should look like from the Odin 3. You will wanna take this open recovery and put that down here. So you can have that to your desktop when you open up the Odin 3. 
Now from there, you close all of this out. This was my first time doing it this morning. And once everything is hooked up, you'll see COM3. And everything will say added at the top. None of that will be here but the added. Once everything is in there, you want to hit start. Make sure that auto root is off. You hit start. Once everything go through, you'll see a blue line all the way through to the side. Once you see that blue line, this is the most important part of all. Most important part. You want to hold the power key and the up volume key and the home button at the same time until you see the Samsung screen pop up. Once you see that, you let go. Then after that, you should see like a red Android body on the front. Once you see the red Android body, it'll be a whole bunch of other writing coming up from the bottom. Already you know that your device is rooted. Just let it go, play through. It'll go out once on the Samsung and then it'll come back and then you go let me um, down click this real quick and I'll show you where you go. You go to the app store and then you get root checker and then you get super U and just download those straight from the app store onto your tablet and you'll be ready to go. Ready and running. Fully ready and running. I'm going to show you right now. I just did mine. I did mine off of somebody else's video who had a 7 inch running on a lower firmware and I just did the math and figured it out real quick and I rooted mine just that fast off of this morning. I'll show you right now. There go root checker. Right off the rip, it says rooted. If it wasn't rooted, it'll say this Galaxy Tab is not rooted. Right now, this is rooted running on Android 5.1.1. So there you go. Root checker has been granted. That's how you root your 8 inch tab 4 running on Android 5.1.1. Now you can downgrade and do it like everybody else and do it easy way with Towler or King Root. That's not the way to go. The way to go is the hard rooted and it's the best way to go. And like I said, just download Root Checker and Super U from the Play Store and you'll be in to go. Any questions or anything, just hit me up in the, in the likes or the subscribe or comments and I'll hit you back and I'll do another video nice and slow, breaking it down nice and easy. It might be a little long, but that's what you need. I'll give it to you. All right, people. Out.